everybody, welcome back to Samsung in a Minute, the channel that trains you on your Samsung Galaxy devices in around two minutes. Today, we'll take a look at the brand new Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6, but more specifically, we'll take a look at all of the tips and tricks and tutorial that you need to know about the taskbar that runs along the bottom. Now, the taskbar is something that pops up when you're inside of any application, and what it does is just allows you to go through all of your different applications, super quick, very easy, even some of your other applications that were the recent app applications. So how you're able to just go through all of the settings on this and the rest of the tips and tricks is you go inside of your settings. As you scroll on down, you'll take a look at display. And then inside of the display settings, this is where you see taskbar. So you are able to turn this one off just right away, but I find it to be super helpful and I believe you'll find it to be helpful as well. So once you have this one turned on, then you're able to take a look at a couple additional settings on the bottom. Out of the box, you were able to have two applications that are set up as your recent applications. And again, you are able to turn the recent apps off, but if you're going through all these different applications on the bottom, like I said from before, it might actually help you just to have it there. So you can have two, three, or four, and it's all separated by this line. So anything on the right hand side of this line is your recent applications. Everything over on the left hand side, these are the applications that are set up on your main home page. So when you take a look at your home page, these are the five that will show up anytime you go inside of any application. So this way you'd be able to go through all of them super quick just by simply tapping on them. But here's the thing, some people might not know this, but you are able to add additional applications towards the very bottom. And what will happen is that this will change and show up in any application you go to, and now you have more applications. So you can change any of these apps on the bottom, and that will change your taskbar when you open up any other application. Now here's the other thing that you can do with this taskbar, is not only are you able to just switch between all of these different applications just super quick and easy, but what you are able to do is you can press and hold on one of them, and you can you know basically place this anywhere you want to. If you want it to be the bottom, if you want it at the top, the right, or the left, you can even put it here where it's pop up. If you put this one sitting right over there, and maybe let's say we have to do something with uh, the settings, so then you can do this as well. So now you have three different applications running at the exact same time, which I think I'll actually just put the internet over here. So you have the internet, you also have your gallery, here's your music. So there's so many different things that you're able to do when it comes down to the setup. You can also switch them all around as well. This is kind of a little bit of part of the taskbar, but I wanna show you, you know, a little bit of these multi-window setups. Now next up with this one, maybe you have a setup that is perfect, you love it, you're actually able to hit star and you can add it to the taskbar your home screen, as well as the app edge panel. So I actually do have one that's saved in my app edge panel over here. It's actually just two Pokemons, but here's another thing that you are also able to do. If you're inside of an application, but you wanna go into something else and you don't see it along the bottom, you're able to tap right there. This shows all the rest of the applications. You're able to swipe on over and you can open up just another application. So let's just go through, let's open up Google News and now you have this one opened. So it's super nice and helpful and easy just to kind of go through your full entire phone. Anytime you go inside of an application, it will pop up on the bottom. But here's the thing, maybe you want to kind of save space uh, and you don't want it to show on the bottom. All you have to do is press and hold anywhere along the bottom, it'll disappear and press and hold anywhere along the bottom and it'll come right back. So that's everything that I wanted to share with you. Once you go inside of any application, your taskbar will show up along the bottom. These are your favorites. These are what's on your home screen. You can add or remove applications. You can open this to open up you know, any more applications and you can just simply drag and drop if you want to have a multi-window screen or you can just simply tap to change from all those applications. You can also make it disappear and have it come right back. So let me know if this video has helped you guys out if it did, give this thing a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later. I got things to soul on my true collective ball. Famous, so, so famous, number one, desirable. I do what I want when I want and how I want it. Leave you with the one in the air. That's how I roll. I got things to soul on my true collective ball. Famous, so, so famous, number one, desirable. I do what I want when I want and how I want it. Leave you with the one in the air. That's how I roll.